channel. If you're new here, I'm Lisa, also known as La Dolce Lisa, and today I have an exciting video for us, fashionistas. Once again, I am doing a clothing haul. But rather than just focusing on one store like my last video, I decided to do a mall clothing haul. So you will see a couple things from some of my favorite stores to shop in, including just, I think I only got one thing from Zara. You'll see a couple things from Forever 21, a couple things from H&M, and a lot of the things I actually happen to get at Winners. Now Winners is our Canadian version of Marshalls. We also have Marshalls, so it's basically Winners and Marshalls here in Canada. It is a store that has a name brands for a significantly Less, and I love shopping there. I just wanted to mention that a lot of things that I purchased, I actually purchased for $40 or under. I think I only have one or two things that are like in the $30 to $40 range. The rest are significantly under, so this is again another affordable clothing haul as well. I love to do affordable shopping, so I hope you guys enjoy these kind of hauls. So without talking too much, let's get started. I think since I only have one item from Zara, we'll just go right in and I'll show you that right away. Okay, so it should be known that I'm basically a size medium in most stores, but you'll probably be seeing my outfits ranging from small to even extra large. It just happens to be that these stores just can't get it right and certain things you can get away with in smalls and some things you have to get larges. I don't know what's up with that, but a lot of my outfit sizes will vary, so I'll just be telling you the sizes and the prices as well. So this first item is from Zara. This was the only thing I picked up at Zara this time around at the mall, but I love this shirt. It's this very pretty pale pink blouse shirt with these little bird detailings on it. I thought this was so cute. This is a size small and the regular price was $39 which is a little bit too much for me for just a shirt. I paid this $22 and I thought that was a great deal because the material feels very nice and silky and smooth and it's just really pretty. I thought this was such a nice piece. Going into the spring season I'm going to be wanting to wear a lot more colors that are very reflective of that soft pinks and you know those sort of floralies and pretty patterns that we like to wear in the springtime so I'll be wearing a lot of baby colors I guess you can say. So at H&M I picked up two things. The first one I'm going to quickly mention because if you saw my Valentine's Day date night looks You'll have already seen this skirt in that video. I kept the tag on because I really want to show you guys this skirt. I absolutely love it. This was the more pricey item that I happened to buy this time around. However, my sister Jen was kind enough to buy this for me, so thanks Jen. <laughs> so I had originally grabbed this in a size six because that's usually what I am in skirts. However, this is actually the kind of skirt that you really need to size down in. So I ended up getting this in a size four. Now this, like I said, was a little bit more pricey at $39.99. However, this is a beautiful, black skirt that will go with everything and the good thing about buying black pieces is the fact that you can wear them so many times and you can change the kind of top that you're wearing with them or your booties put, add pops of color make it an all black outfit you can do whatever you want with these kind of things and you can get away with wearing them multiple times without anyone even noticing at all it has this nice little fuzzy detailing so it adds just an extra depth of, of interest really when it comes to this kind of piece but I thought it was so cute it comes with a little belt but you could of course pop your own little belt in as well I thought that this was a great skirt it was a little bit more on the pricey side but again everything is going to be this price or less in this mall haul so I hope you guys will enjoy that now the next thing from H&M the next and final thing I should say the material when I bought this, it's almost the same as that skirt. Instead of it being like the lines that go across, it's actually these little fuzzy prints that almost end up looking leopardy in a way. Now, the only reason why I got this was because when I was at the mall with Jules, she pointed these out to me and she was like, these are 10 bucks, you gotta get them. And I was like, you know what, you're absolutely right. So they of course are $10, you can't go wrong. Sorry, the original price was $39.99. The thing about these is that they are high-waisted, so they sit very nicely on. However, they are a bit short, but they're meant to be short, so the good thing about that is that you can wear them with really pretty shoes and have your shoes be the star of your outfit, which is a really exciting thing. This was actually in a size eight, so the kind of interesting thing about these is that these I had to get in a size eight from the same store, but the skirt, which is very similar, another high waisted item, I had to get in a size four. So it just goes to show you how different the sizing can be at these kind of stores. But I really like this, and I thought for $10, this was an absolute steal. Next, I have a couple things from Forever 21. 
I of course love shopping at Forever 21. They are getting a little bit more pricey, which is unfortunate because the reason why I love them so much was because they were so inexpensive. However, I always shop the sale section, so these are always, of course, sale items. They're having a buy one, get one free. So this t-shirt was in a large, original price, $20. I got it for $9. You can never have enough just like a basic t-shirt to work out in at the gym, I feel like, and this is kind of cute as well. I mean, it will be a little bit more form-fitting than my usual t-shirts. My sister Jules makes fun of me sometimes because I'm always going to the gym in just these like huge t-shirts because I feel so comfortable in them. So I guess to look a little bit cuter while I'm working out, I just picked up this cute little shirt. I like the pink. I like the stripes. I guess I'm in a pink mood all the time at Forever 21 because I always seem to be getting things in pink. And like I said, it was buy one, get one free in the sales section. So I basically paid these $4.50 each if you want to do the math. So this was a cute pink crop top style shirt. This was in a medium. It had this interesting button detailing. I hope that this doesn't show a little bit too much because sometimes you know when you get those shirts and like your button is popping out over your chest area. I hope that it doesn't do that too much, but if it does, it's okay. I mean, the price was so affordable. I thought this was cute. I love this pink color. And I like that this was a nice wintry piece as well. Slowly I'm adding some colors of spring with these wintry items. It's just a nice sweater crop top from Forever 21 and you really can't go wrong. These two items were the buy one get one free again so they were both in the sale item. This sweater was actually more expensive than that dress so I'll just show you the sweater first. This was in a large and this the sale price was $15. The original price was $33. It seems like a soft material and that it won't be too itchy so I hope that is the case as well. I really like this to be honest. I bought it specifically for these shoulders. I feel like it's sort of like an off the shoulder type sweater but instead of being completely off the shoulder there's these little bows that will hang on your shoulders and that should look really cute. So that bow detailing was just a really nice touch to the sweater. It gave it a little bit of an elevation so instead Instead of being a basic pink sweater it just gave it that much more interest to the actual piece and I thought that was really nice and exciting I don't really have a sweater like this and I thought since it was buy one get one free I would take advantage of that sale I picked up this dress now this dress was five dollars so unfortunately this was free it would have been nice to get the other one for free but that's okay this was five dollars and you can't really go wrong for that price for some reason this doesn't have the original price on it maybe that's even why it was for sale i didn't see any other sizes in this it just had this item in a large which is okay because i don't mind getting dresses at forever 21 in larges i feel like at least they're long and they're not too short so i don't mind that at all it comes with like a, a strappy dress underneath and on top of it it is this thin lace see-through detailing i like that it had little short sleeves i thought that was a nice touch who doesn't love a little black dress and for five dollars you can't go wrong i feel like these sort of peekaboo detailings where it's like see and don't see are very in right now as well when they're having such great sales at forever 21 you really can't go wrong next i have all my winners slash marshall's shopping items to show you guys i have quite a bit from there so that is going to be what the rest of the haul is about now I'll just talk about, I guess, some shirts first because I have a couple just basic cute shirts. This one was in a size small and this was a $19.99 and it is just your basic cute button up shirt. It has this really pretty cherry pattern on top of this white and blue striped shirt. I'm seeing a lot of these button up shirts with these nice prints on it and I feel like that's going to be really in for spring. Not to mention I've been seeing a lot of stripes lately as well so I feel like stripe is just a trend that you should be on top of for this coming spring of course. This is actually in a size medium and this is those kind of shirts that you wrap around sort of like the one that I'm wearing right now. This was again $19.99 so I thought this was really cute with the polka dots and the florals and this blue color. I thought this was so pretty for spring as well and I like that the sleeve was this nice quarter sleeve type deal again perfect for spring and you really can't go wrong speaking of shirts with cute spring like patterns on them I already had the cherry print and the floral print what's missing for spring or summer lemon print of course I love lemon print it's actually something that I feel like I overdid a little bit last year it's funny because when we went to Italy if you saw our Italy vlogs me my sister and my boyfriend one day when we went to Positano we all wore lemon print shirts and my sister's boyfriend also wore a floral print shirt so when people saw us they're like oh you guys are the lemons 
lemons and he's like the flowers of the lemons. So needless to say, when we got back from Positano to Adolfi, we all ran home and we changed out of our lemon print outfits that day. But I still can't seem to get enough of lemon print. And for $19.99, Canadian of course, I thought this was such a cute shirt. Instead of being a button up shirt, it is actually a zip up shirt, which can be quite nice. White and lemon prints I feel like are so classic. This has a cute cinching at the waist detailing. So this will be very flattering and easy to wear with just even a pair of jeans or tights. You have a cute little outfit here. This was actually in a size small and it was $19.99 if I didn't already tell you that. Throw it on, you're good to go. You have a nice little spring slash summer outfit. So I don't know the size, but I'm pretty sure I saw it on a medium or large hanger. I can't remember, but of course this is men's. So it is going to be super oversized. It is very long on me. The interesting thing about men's shirts is that the buttons are on the other side. So it's sort of funny to put on these kind of shirts, but I love this. The original price was well, the winner's price was $30. The original price that it had on the sticker actually said comparable to $100. But of course, I bought this for $11 on sale. Now, this was a steal, and I really like this because even though it was a men's shirt, it looks like a woman's shirt with this pretty flower detailing. And I like the idea of actually wearing a men's shirt and having it look cute with a little cinched belt. It is perfect. You can wear it from winter to spring, and you'll just look great in that kind of outfit. I like that it was long sleeve and I thought that it was a steal for $11 Canadian. So I love V-neck. This was a size medium and I got it for $29.99. Now this is just a really pretty shirt because it has that thick lace detailing and the sleeves are that see-through lace but it's very thick. Of course it is not see-through where it counts so your chest will be covered just fine. There's a little bit of a peekaboo see-throughness at the waist and then it flares out to be a peplum style shirt. And for $24.99, the price was pretty good. I got these high-waisted pants. They were $29.99. Now this says size Canadian 8. So I love that these pants are striped. I love that they're high-waisted. And I love when high-waisted pants have a tie string around the waist because I feel like that is so flattering. If they don't, you can always just wear it with a belt or things like that. I did already try these on and the length just fits just right. So they are not too long and they're not too short. It is almost the perfect length. Hopefully they don't shrink anymore in the wash because I hate when my pants do that. But I thought that these were very pretty and even though they were close to $30, I think that it is worth it because the material feels very thick and luxurious. Next, the last clothing item was actually on a super sale. This was these pants in a size large and I got them for $11. Now this was a steal because high-waisted pants for $11 is a great price, similar to those H&M pants. When they are that inexpensive, I just have to grab them. They have such pretty details on them. I love this print. It is a floral print with also this almost like meshy fishnet style print on them as well. For $11, you cannot go wrong. So I'm happy that I found those. Those were the last ones I found. That's actually the thing about shopping at Winners or Marshalls. Sometimes in order to find an amazing piece, you really have to look and hunt for it. And some people just don't have the patience. But if you do, I really recommend going to that kind of store because you can get such amazing finds for such great prices, especially in their clearance sections. I always keep an eye out for that section because you do find such great deals like those Kind of pants as well. Now, speaking of clearance items, this was an absolute steal. So the winner's price was $59.99, which is pretty good as it is. But of course, I found these on clearance for $22. And I think that's what gave me the courage to purchase these electric blue suede type boots. They are that like crush velvet or suede like material, whatever you want to call these. They are beautiful. They are such a statement piece. They're a crazy pop of color. They have this interesting heel, so it's quite high, but because it is so thick, it should be pretty comfortable as well. I thought these were so unique and pretty, and I'm quite glad that I found these and for such a steal. So you can get these at Marshalls or Winners right now. If you're quick about it, they'll probably be going fast. I was actually impressed that they had my size, which is a size nine in boots, and I'm very excited. So there we go, guys. That concludes my mall shopping haul. I hope you like this kind of video. If you'd rather see me focus on one specific store, just let me know in the comments below. Or if you like the idea of me accumulating a couple items from the mall and then showing you some of my favorite finds, let me know as well. Please give me a thumbs up if you love these kind of haul videos. And please, of course, subscribe to my channel as I'll be making many more videos like this in the future. So I'm just going to be saying bye for now and let me know if you liked any of these specific items as well. This was so
so fun to do guys so i will see you in my next video bye